And we're back at 6.57. Good morning. Time now for our Sunrise Sports Start. Rochester police say two people are in custody after a shooting on High Street. The road was closed for several hours around 11 p.m. last night. And area residents were being asked to shelter in place. That has since been lifted. Police say they were trying to get a person out of the house there. That road has since reopened and the investigation continues. Temporary morgues are being set up in Monroe County as health officials prepare for more deaths. 31 people have died from the virus locally. As for confirmed cases, there are now 570 in Monroe County. Of those, 83 people are in the hospital. Officials add 236 cases have resolved at this point, and those people have been released from isolation. New York State hit its single largest spike in deaths yesterday, with more than 730 people dying from COVID-19, bringing the death toll to over 5,000. The number of cases has also gone up to more than 100 and 38,000 across the state. The governor says projections show that New York State could be nearing the apex. Senate Minority Leader Chuck Schumer is calling for doctors, nurses, grocery store clerks, and other essential workers to receive up to $25,000 in hazard pay. The money would be part of the Phase 4 coronavirus relief bill. According to Schumer, if approved, the money would be given to employers who would then distribute the payments to employees. Well, not as warm today, but still a decent day on tap, right, Josh? Yeah, that's right. Not too tough to take. Certainly not the sunny sensation that a good chunk of yesterday was. In fact, a good chunk of the day today will be cloudy, but the breeze will be light. And it will start to dry out later this afternoon. As far as temperatures are concerned, the normal high is right around 53, and that's uh, pretty much what we will realize today in Rochester. A little bit cooler by the water's edge of Lake Ontario, just a little bit milder over parts of the southern tier. And uh, what you see is what you get here is, like I mentioned, for a good chunk of the day, a lot of cloud cover. But look off to the northwest later this afternoon. You should see some breaks in the clouds trying to develop. The next front, not that far off, promises to bring some rain again, much like what we had last night, later tonight. But not this evening. We'll actually see a little bit of clearing uh, late this afternoon and into this evening. And again, uh, a decent Wednesday ahead. All right. Thank you so much. And thank you for watching News 8 at Sunrise. Our next update is coming up in 25 minutes. CBS This Morning starts right now. Be safe. Have a great day.